I am delighted to be amongst you today to celebrate United Nations Day. It is a day to reflect on why the United Nations was founded and to remember with appreciation all its agencies and people who have sacrificed greatly to make the world a better place. To them, I offer my deepest gratitude. I acknowledge with deep appreciation all the UN staff in Bhutan for their dedication and committed service to the people of Bhutan. Every day is an opportunity to invest in the future of humanity and each of us is responsible for a better tomorrow. It is in this spirit that I have been associated with the UNFPA and the United Nations for the past two decades. I wish to thank Dr. Natalia Kanin, Executive Director of UNFPA and her team who have travelled all the way to Bhutan to present me with an award of appreciation. I am extremely touched and honoured to receive this recognition for my role as UNFPA Goodwill Ambassador. I most humbly accept this award on behalf of all who have tirelessly worked along with me to advance the rights and provide choices for women and girls in Bhutan. I draw great inspiration from His Majesty the King and His Majesty the Fortrip Gelpo, role models for all of us to emulate. My parents loved and encouraged each of us nine siblings equally, regardless of gender, to realize our full potential. My mother and my late father have been examples of simplicity, hard work and tenacity. To them I offer my love and gratitude. My long association with people from all walks of life across the country has left an indelible impact and gives me the strength and purpose to continue to strive to make a difference in their lives. Bhutan today is very different from what it was 20 years ago. Our social indicators have surpassed our expectations. Maternal and infant mortality rates have declined. Almost all our girls are in schools and female literacy has improved. But much, much more needs to be done and we pledge to persevere relentlessly till every girl child and woman can hold their head high as equal partners in every sphere. Finally, as we are in the abode of Tara, considered as the mother of all withers and goddess of compassion, may her ability to act swiftly without delay bring success on all our endeavors in championing the cause of all sentient beings, especially women and every girl child all over the world. Thank you, Mr.